Hey, I'm a little excited about this here. Amazon just dropped this off. It's a little tech, little plan for my Mac Pro Tower. Hey everybody, what's up? It's PJ the Great, your tech fanboy, and And my last vlog, if you guys are just tech fans and if you pay attention to my vlogs from time to time, and you know, if you don't, maybe you might want to. You can check it out right um, here. I hope I got that right, but it's up there somewhere. But anyway, I noticed that my vlog kind of took a turn for the tech and I was so excited to upgrade my new old 2010 Mac Pro that I kind of slid it into the vlog. Well, there's a lot of details and a lot of stuff that I didn't include in that vlog because I wanted to include it in a separate Tech Tuesday video. But basically what I did is I upgraded my 2010 Mac Pro Tower to let me show you so I installed this in my Mac Pro tower this is USB 3.0 put in my Mac Pro so because you know it's a 2010 so it doesn't have 3.0 in it it only had 2.0 so I upgraded that and I also upgraded well added a hard drive so here is the extended version of what I shared in my past Saturday vlog I hope you techies enjoy it I want to show you this another plan for the Mac Pro kind of have a computer graveyard out here this is an old PC tower that I had a couple years ago I tried to upgrade it to Windows 8 and I think I crashed the system I'm hoping I didn't crash the hard drive that's the reason why I still have it because I don't want to get rid of it and all my stuff is on there but it's a one terabyte hard drive in there. I'm going to try and pull it out and put that in my Mac Pro and use it as a second hard drive. Might as well get some use out of it, right? Yeah, this is my computer graveyard. That's my old iMac. I gave it to my mom and then a couple years later it blew up on her. And this is another iMac. My mom bought this one when that one blew up. And then a year later, this one blew up. So now she's on a PC. And since we're talking computer graveyards, I thought I would show you this. That's another one. That one works. That one fully works. That's my old Mac Mini I had hooked up to the living room. But when I bought my Mac Pro Tower, I put my old... Mac Mini that was in my office in here because it's better than that other one okay so that was quite the chore but I got it out of there this is the old hard drive from that PC I'm hoping I didn't fry it when it was in the PC when I tried to upgrade it to Windows 8 I accidentally hit a button and it stopped and it wouldn't turn on after that and I wanted to get the RAM out of there so maybe I can put that RAM in my other PC because I'm pretty sure it's not going to work in that Mac Pro but this should if this isn't fried and Mac Pro has four bays for hard drives so like hey, it's one terabyte and here's that Amazon package. I'll go ahead and show you guys what that is. There it is. Inatech. It's USB 
3.0 because that old Mac Tower only has 2.0 and I have two external 3.0 hard drives so I'm trying to increase the speed so I'm hoping with this and this I'll be able to increase my video editing speed because I can temporarily dump my video on here and then edit and export and then these or this I should say should speed up my two external hard drives all right got my USB 3.0 card and my old one terabyte drive from a fried PC and I'm gonna dump these in there I'm gonna go ahead and crack it open and we'll see if it works there's that old slow video card that will be replaced soon it's on its way from Hong Kong so as soon as it gets here it's going bye bye so I'm gonna install my USB threes here and then that other hard drive here okay so I had to take the old hard drive out <laughs> to see how to mount this one in so I got got it in so now I'm going to put these both back in all right got my USB 3.0 in there and that hard drive let's see if it works Both of my external hard drives showed up. They are currently plugged into the USB 3.0s, so that's a good sign. Let's check on that hard drive. And there's my second hard drive. I gotta format it though so that it works on the Mac. Okay, everybody, welcome back. Thank you for watching. That was my brief little upgrade to my 2010 Mac Pro. I'm gonna continue to play around with it. I absolutely love this because back in my PC days, I used to do this all the time to my PCs. I would rip old parts out, put in new parts, put in additional parts. Then once I switched over to Mac, I wasn't able to do that. And now this Mac Pro tower that I have allows me to do that. So yes, outdated is seven years old. One sound seven years old. But it's running Mac OS Sierra and it's allowing me to upgrade as I go along as I see fit. And the next upgrade is a video card because it still has a stock video card in it. And that thing is horribly, horribly slow. My video exporting times is like beyond ridiculous like a 10 minute video on my old mac mini server i7 would take like maybe 10 minutes 12 minutes it's taking like this thing 30 minutes to export a 10 minute video ain't nobody got time for that ain't nobody got time for that so that's in the mail on the way thank you guys for watching if you like the video give it a thumbs up and happy tech tuesday to you and until the next video deuces